Welcome to the Integrated Collection System tutorial. On the home page, you can find the latest news and the most updated documents details. Under the Register tab, or on the top right of the home page, you can sign in or register an account in the ICS. Under the Report Calendar tab, you can find all the reporting cycles of different sectors data. If you have any questions regarding the ICS, you can use the Help tab or the Need Help widget on the bottom right to find the relevant information. User Registration On the User Registration page, please complete the requested correspondent information and click Next. The next step is to select relevant reports to submit. All the relevant reports are organized by sectors you have to select at least one report domain before going to the next step. At the same time, you also have the option to register as a coordinator or correspondent. Each IMF member country coordinator is responsible for overseeing its data reporting. After you choose the relevant sector and role, you can click Next. Before final submission, you have a chance to preview your information to make sure everything is accurate. Then, you can click Submit. Data and Metadata Once you log into your account, you will see the home page with the sectors you selected during registration and a reporting country. You can set up the reporting preferences by clicking the Configure button. You can submit data in Excel or SDMX. SDMX data reporting include Global SDMX ML and ODP ECOFIN SDMX. After selecting a reporting preference, you can choose the reporting action, upload, download, or submit SDMX and metadata questionnaire. When you choose the SDMX as your reporting preference, you can use the setting button to set up a web URL and use the submit button for data submit. An offline submission is also possible if the web URL setting is not available. For the DSBB metadata submission, you should click the metadata button under the reporting actions. Then you can find three options. Advanced Release Calendar Editor, Certification Editor, and Metadata Editor. You can pick the one you want to update. More details about the metadata reporting can be found in the Help page. Manage Registration Request, Correspondent, and Data Domains. If you are registered as a coordinator, you will have the right to manage correspondent requests and data domain permissions of your correspondent. A correspondent is defined as a user who is assigned reporting permissions for at least one data domain but has zero coordinating permissions. Manage correspondence. A coordinator can approve or reject open user registration and rights change requests submitted by the correspondents in the Manage Request module. A coordinator can also request to change the profile information and reporting permissions of their correspondents in the Manage Correspondent module. If a correspondent is a coordinator for one or more data domains, his or her profile and rights cannot be edited by another coordinator. The View Status icon will indicate whether the listed correspondent's profile is editable. Reporting permissions able to be edited or approved by a coordinator will be limited to the set of his or her own coordinating permissions. By clicking the Add Correspondent or Contact button on the upper right, a coordinator can request an authenticated and authorized ICS web application account for another user of the same reporting country or entity. A logged-in coordinator can nominate another user to have reporting permissions of data domains within the same country in the Manage module. The approval process will be equivalent to that of open user registration except the request will by default hold a coordinator approved status. Finally, you can also manage your own data domains based on needs under the My Data Domains module. Thank you for watching the Integrated Collection System tutorial.